Hi, in this video we're basically going to show you how you can set up your IP camera on your network and view it from your PC or laptop using a program called PSS, which stands for a Professional Security System, okay? Um, traditionally people might use NVRs with hard drives in them and things like this and you can access the hard or the NVR from your PC, but if you don't want to buy an NVR, you could just use the PC or laptop uh, to view um, your uh you know your live streams things like this and in further videos we'll show you how you can use the pc to actually record the live streams okay so to do this uh we use this program called pss i'll just pull it up here now so you can see it's blank and there's no devices in it so obviously the first thing we would have done is we would have um got our ip camera and set the ip address on it okay and we've shown that in another video how you do this using a program called uh, config tool okay so we have that uh, the IP address changed on the camera and we have it uh, plugged into our router directly, okay? So to add the camera to um, our system here inside this program called PSS, we want to go to Config Manager and we want to go to Device Manage. So there's no devices here currently, so what we want to do is search device. And we can see the camera here that I've set up and connected into my router. So it, the IP address of it is 192.168.1.175. Okay, so we just tick it and we go add to device list. Do you really want to add this? Yes. And we click OK. So what you can see here then is it fills in all the blanks here and that's all well and good. So what we do then simply uh, would be to press OK and then we can go on to the next section. But something just to note here would be that what would be advisable would be to change the password of your IP camera. Um, when you're setting it up because by default uh, the IP cameras by Xvision have um, you know pa uh, default passwords as uh, username admin and password admin so obviously you'd want to change the password to something you know semi complicated but something obviously you'd remember yourself so we're going to uh, press OK so you can see here then in the device list it's suddenly appeared and we get this prompt down below so what you want to do here then is simply click on the IP address if you double click on it you'll get a prompt saying it's successfully logged in. Okay, if it didn't successfully log in, there might be something wrong with your uh, network settings or perhaps uh, you have the wrong password or something like that. So just make sure. So the next thing then is we click on the plus symbol and we have this IPC uh, symbol here. Okay, so what you want to do then is you want to click on the window you want it to appear in and then just double click IPC. So you can see here now I have the camera set up and I'm viewing it there in real time and that's basically it so things you can do here is you can double click it enlarge it to full screen things like that you can zoom in there's a little symbol uh, up the top here the zoom on this particular camera that i just have set up as a demo uh, it wouldn't be great um but it's just an example uh just showing you how you set it up um so that's basically it how you can um set up the ip camera on your network and view it from your pc uh, using a program called PSS.